There was no better place to celebrate Australia Day than the foreshore at Airlie Beach with plenty of wine, food and tropical sunshine. And while the kids have gone back to school, there's still plenty of visitors keeping the Whitsundays busy. One of the big projects getting underway is a $50 million refurbishment of Daydream Island, ahead of expansion into the Chinese tourist market. Owners China Capital Investment Group want to transform the island into a four and a half star world-class resort. Meanwhile, January saw a proposal for a new tourist drive to link hinterland dams across the Mackay Whitsunday region. The property market continued its strong run into the new year with properties like this home receiving multiple offers and selling at the asking price. With results finalised for the September quarter, we see PRD dominating the Whitsundays market, with 33% of the Early Beach market, 38% of the Cannonvale market and a whopping 50% of the Jubilee pocket market. Looking at the sectors, PRD accounted for 38% of the market in units and continues to be the land experts with half of all sales facilitated by our one office. February will be another great month for the market and for the Whitsundays, with the highlight on the calendar being the Whitsundays Wedding and Honeymoon Expo. The Whitsundays, great place to get married, great place to visit and great place to invest. <laughs>